Good morning, students. Today I shall take uh, the different types of angles. So firstly, to start with, types of angles. Number one, acute angle. An acute angle Or <coughs> an angle whose measure is greater than zero degree, but less than 90 degree is called an acute angle. For example, for example, you can see If you draw a straight line or the base line, you see this is 90 degree. This is 90 degree. If we remove the protector and join this dot with the base line, it forms an angle of 90 degree. So acute angle is less than 90 degree or it will be somewhere here acute angle but it will be zero then I mean greater than zero degree this is zero degree this is 90 degree so acute angle will be somewhere in between this in between this so it can be this one acute angle acute angle acute angle so you just remember that an acute angle is an angle whose measure is less than 90 degree but greater than 0 degree. I hope you have understood. So in my last class I have already discussed that this is a protector. You will find this one in your instrument box or geometry box. Uh, it is much uh, smaller than this. This one is uh, huge in size. So you can see here. This is a protector. This is the baseline. Here 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. It will go up to 180. Or you can count from this side. <coughs> this side also. 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 up to 180. So you can count from this side also. From this side also. That means you can measure an angle from this side also from this side also. So this is 90 degree. Now you see, I have told you an acute angle that means it will lie if you measure it from this side. So an acute angle will lie somewhere here, somewhere here in between this. So this can be acute angle, 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 but it should not be greater than 90 degree. The next one is obtuse angle. Obtuse angle. An angle whose measure is greater than 90 degree but less than 180 degree is called an is called an obtuse angle. For example, this is 90 degree. This is a baseline. 
so we know this is 90 degree is 90 degree so if you extend this line that means this is a straight line a straight line is 180 degree a straight line is or you can say from this side if you count it or if you measure it from this side if you consider this one 0 it will be 180 degree this angle this angle will be 180 degree so here 90 here 90 90 90 180 degree so obtuse angle will be more than 90 degree so obtuse angle will be more than 90 degree this can be this angle the new this line you see this is an obtuse angle this is also an obtuse angle this is also an obtuse angle so up to here this will be obtuse angle that means it should be less than 180 degree but it should be greater than 90 degree that is obtuse angle I hope you have <coughs> understood the next one is right angle an angle whose measure is ex exactly 90 degree is called is called a right angle I have already shown to you still <coughs> this is the baseline so this is 90 degree remove the protector and join the point with this line so this angle form is called 90 degree or a right angle so this is 90 degree so 90 degree angle means right angle so next one straight angle straight angle an angle whose measure is exactly 180 degree is called a straight angle you see your protector this is a straight line or the baseline if you draw this one you see if you count from this side 0 this will be 180 so this angle form is 180 degree That means this is 90 degree, this is 90 degree, if you ex this is 90 degree, if you extend this line, if you extend this line it makes a straight line from 0 10 20 it is 90 degree if you extend this line this also becomes this side this angle also become 90 degree so 90 plus 90 is 180 so a straight angle is exactly 180 degree I hope you have understood there are some more angles like what is reflex, reflex angle, complete angle, reflex angle is an angle whose measure is greater than 180 degree but less than 360 degree, 
and a complete angle is exactly 360 degree is called a complete angle so this one is not included in your syllabus so I have just explained to you what a reflex and com uh, complete angle is so thank you very much we will continue in our next class